So there's probably a good chance that you enjoy eating pomegranates. Well, today I want to emphasize why it may not be beneficial to consume pomegranates immediately before bed as it may lower melatonin levels. So for those of you who are brand new to my channel, my name is Lucas. I'm the founder of Ergogenic Health and my mission is to give you guys cutting edge health information that you'll struggle to find on Google. So please be sure to smash that subscribe button below for more epic health information. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share my screen and show you the study that I found that illustrates how mel uh, pomegranate consumption may actually interfere with um, melatonin levels. So basically this study looked at the effects of fresh pomegranate juice on the level of melatonin, insulin, and fasting serum glucose levels in healthy individuals and people with impaired fasting glucose. And what they identified was that after one hour following pomegranate juice consumption, uh, there was a significant drop in, in the levels of melatonin and a significant increase in insulin. So I'll explain that a little bit further. I've highlighted some other areas uh, to focus on. And by the way, guys, there's an inverse relationship usually between um, melatonin and insulin. So they have an antagonistic relationship. Uh, but as you can see here, as shown in the figure above, melatonin was, sign was significantly decreased one hour after drinking pomegranate juice in healthy individuals and people with impaired fasting glucose. And the other key point was that the percentage of reduction in melatonin was approximately 40.8% in people with impaired fasting glucose, while this percentage was about 45.8% healthy individuals. So that's a pretty whopping or big drop in melatonin levels. Uh, in contrast, insulin levels were found to increase one hour after pomegranate juice uh, administration. Bear in mind, guys, that uh, we want insulin to rise following a meal because it helps to shuttle the glucose into the cell. So that's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, obviously, it would be frustrating if you consume that and then did a blood test for fasting insulin. You know, if you didn't fast and you had pomegranate juice, it would obviously impair your, your results. Um, what they found was that therefore a functional antagonism between melatonin and, in and insulin might exist. That's what I mentioned before. Um, so guys, I found this study quite fascinating. Um, I'm a huge fan of pomegranates. I think that they are a very versatile fruit. They have potent anti-inflammatory um, properties. They a strong uh, antioxidant compounds in there. They're anti-carcinogenic, anti-arthrogenic. They are anti-hyperglycemic. They can support blood vessel function. They can improve nitric oxide, but you may want to avoid consuming pomegranates later in the evening and swap it out and consume it um, in the morning or lunchtime so it doesn't interfere with melatonin because remember, sleep trumps and nothing can outperform a good night's sleep. Uh, so guys, if you want to actually learn more about optimizing sleep, I have designed a free sleep course. You can see the link to that in the video description. Check out all the other amazing links in the video description. Check out my website. I have some very, very uh, powerful products on there. Um, but otherwise, guys, thanks for tuning in. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video.